Hey everybody, this is Joby, and today I have some very cool stuff to show you. Maybe this can make up for the disappointing luxury furnishing vendor uh, this past weekend. I'm in, I'm in the Gold Coast right now, which is right here. This is the uh, Dark Brotherhood area. This is me right here, and over here will be uh, Usbane, and it's right next to Malibal Tour. All right, so where you're going to go is to Kvatch. And inside Kavach, you'll just go from the Way Shrine right up here around the corner. We can go this way too. And there you are, you see, Furnisher and the Achievement Furnisher. I think there's some very neat items in here. This is the Home Goods Furniture Furnisher. We want to talk to Athragar Gor. Gur, gur, gur. I don't know. All right, first thing is the banner of the Kavach Guard, 15K. Now I have all the achievements here, so. I do not know what they entail, and uh, I cannot remember. It's been a long time. Here you go. Blade of Woe replica. If you don't have the Blade of Woe, it's definitely something you need to come get. Very cool. Very convenient. Brotherhood Poison Vial. 2,500. Dark Brotherhood Banner. Love it. Pretty good. What is the color of night? Sanguine, my brother. Always love that. The Dark Ledger. I do not know if you can read that. I would uh, I'd like to know if you can read it. Just might buy it. This is great. Gold Coast Estate Keg. Open. Closed. Don't know if you can go inside it or not. But uh, definitely cool. Some of the quests you do that kind of stuff. Hanging Hourglass. Man, awfully tiny. The Hourglass Rug with some wings on it. Time flies. Wah, 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 wah. Litany of Blood. Again, I don't know if you can read it. Be great if you could. Order of the Hour Banner. You can get that motif style here from doing the uh, arena. Preserved Sweet Rolls. Hmm. These are a trophy that commemorate thwarting the Sweet Roll Killer of the Gold Coast. Yeah, if you ate those things, it looks like you'd die from diabetes. Pretty bad. I like this. Sanctuary sconce. Lid. Extinguished. Lid. I think that's very good. And the creme de la creme piece de resistance. Statue of the Mother. It's the uh, Night Mother. The patron goddess of the Dark Brotherhood. That's pretty cool. 100,000, but still. Not really that big, but, uh, man, you can make a really cool display with the stained glass window and her below it and the Blade of Woe in her lap. Pretty good for themed, you know, houses and stuff like that. I think um, this is one of the best places if you like the Dark Brotherhood. If you don't, you know, I understand, but uh, it's... Pretty good stuff if you like that, you know, sneaking around, stabbing stuff. I know Skyrim had a big deal with all that, and you get to kill the Emperor and everything. Not so much in uh, ESO about the story, but uh, I definitely liked it. I liked the quest line. I thought it was very fun. And if you do have this DLC and you want to come here, you just end up going over to this place right here. Just straight up from Gold Coast Way Shrine, and uh, it will be the Dark Brotherhood Sanctuary. Don't take companions in there. Uh, they do not like it. And one of them dislikes it the most. I think it's Bastion. Really doesn't like going in there. And, you know, they don't like you to kill people with a blade of woe. And you'll lose rapport if uh, you are into companions. Well, that's really about it. I just wanted to show you this achievement furniture that I found. Um, I had never even seen this stuff here. And I was looking around to do the videos. And I thought I wonder what they have and I came here and uh, I might have come here a long time ago I can't remember but I look at it with a new pair of eyes now that I'm a Barbie doll house owner and operator and uh, I like this stuff in there I've always liked the Thieves Guild and the Dark Brotherhood there's a lot of great passives if you do the Dark Brotherhood there's something in here uh, if you have the skill line and this is something that I think is amazing uh, it's probably worth it just to be able to uh, have this passive do the whole skill line and it's called shadow rider 
aggression radius from hostile monsters is decreased by 50% while mounted. Whenever you're out and you're doing surveys and stuff, as long as you're mounted, you can ride really close to uh, evil NPCs and they will not bother you. This is another one, Shadowy Supplier. If you go to any Thieves Guild and look for the hand, you can walk up to that guy and ask him for equipment or poisons. I always ask for equipment. Yesterday I got a pair of Sithis Breaches and uh, I didn't have them, so I bound them. And I think uh, it's very, very useful. But Shadow Rider is awesome. All right, so please give me a like and a subscribe if you enjoyed the content. And uh, leave a comment in the comment section. Do you like this stuff at this uh, achievement vendor? Do you like the Dark Brotherhood? Have you done the skill line? Just uh, tell me what you think about, you know, the different uh, DLCs. What's your favorite? And um, I'm always interested to know. Join me on Discord, the most chill Discord server on the planet. There's a link in the description. Uh, in the Discord, you might come in there and look like it's dead. But if you just ask a question, somebody will answer. There's about 600 people in there. Most of the people are probably busy with their lives and other things. Um, not a lot of off-game chatting, but if somebody starts a quest uh, conversation about uh, the game or has a question, people will answer. And if you're not doing anything, 8.15 p.m. Eastern Time, follow me on Twitch. Upper Echelon Mediocrity is the name of the channel. Have a lot of fun in there. Yesterday we did Red Pedal Bastion Hard Mode, and it was great. Shout out to Mini Tanker 33 Jihee, and J-Rod for that. We had a great time. Hard on that dungeon, you have to do all three or all of the bosses in hard mode. That's the boss with the goats, and he's like 12 million, and the the final boss is like 18 million. We we died. We wiped twice, and then uh, lots of dying going on. We might have wiped three times. I don't know, but uh, we did get it done. And when you do hard mode in these new dungeons, you get two motifs, guaranteed. And uh, I think that's pretty excellent. If you're on Xbox, North American server, you can join my guild. My guild's name is Upper Echelon Mediocrity, just like the YouTube channel. And right now we have 485 total members, no members pending, 43 people online. Lots of helpful, friendly people and uh, lots of crafters and provisioners and potion makers. So anything you need, people can get with you and help you out. We're not in the guild finder, so you need to send me a message on Xbox. My name is Coyote, C-H-A-O-T-E-Y, and I'll get you in as soon as time permits. So until that time, let's get paid.